There we go. First, I would like to thank everyone for, for attending the marriage ceremonies today and coming to this reception dinner tonight. I suppose it's now time for me, the best man, to sing praises of Brian and tell him his better qualities. I thought it would be easy until I thought about the fact that I can't sing or run a liar, so <laughs> it's not going to work. Another problem with being the best man is the fact that you never get to prove it, so Brian, be glad Brian and Megan found you before she truly discovered me. <laughs> <laughs> Brian and I have been our best friends as well as brothers, and we grew up in a way that would reflect that. I definitely reflected upon Brian's mistakes while we grew up. My only thoughts were, if I don't do what Brian did, maybe I'll stay out of trouble. He usually worked out, but I honestly believe the tough discipline Dad put on Brian made him the man he is today, as well as all my dominated victories over him in all the possible competitive categories. <laughs> Brian and I, I grew up competing with one another, whether it was a dunking contest on the basketball ramble in the closet door, or the five-yard football drill to see if I could stop him from scoring. That was full contact, by the way, and I was like six. <laughs> <laughs> Brian made it hard on me. He would do it all from dunking on me, tackling me, or simply knocking the baseball 100 yards of passion and making me run good. It. it all turned out all right, though. <laughs> I have been there through all of Brian's passion relationships, and I'm glad to say to Megan that 45 is actually her lucky number. But as soon as I saw Megan and Brian together, it was obvious to me that it was a love that would last forever. They just seemed like two pieces of a huge puzzle that just seemed to fit. I'm truly honored to have my brother marry a wonderful woman like Megan. I truly believe she is a rare find. Today is your day, ma'am. I hope it was one that both of you will remember as the day your love truly began. Just remember, all marriages are happy. It's the living together afterwards that causes all the problems. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 